Hello, everybody. Uh, I am from Lulu University. I just to present uh, the, um, for instead of my supervisors. It is about exploring the limit for additive manufacturing and defined uh, the defects. Uh, one difference between uh, the pro established products between uh, that uh, based upon the additive manufacturing and the metal sheet is that involving uh, the uh, such an defects and imperfections like, for example, porous and lack of effusions also. And often uh, for the metal shield products is defined the standardizations and also the strengths, but the uh, very critical thing is about the welded. It is a very, I mean, that restricted and with the very narrow zones, it's so risky, but it is a proposed for get better understanding uh, to uh, study the impact of such an defects like the porous on the strength of the product. Uh, like this here, for the example, are the upper figures, the finite element analysis of the stress, and uh, actually uh, the whole, eventually, it is about the definitions and the understanding, the limits and the control at which the product after that it can be fails under its loading situation. It means that now the situation is to accept such an certain imperfections and uh, the others is not, therefore it needs to be standardized. And upon these definitions it also enables for the example tailoring uh, such an innovative product designs for the metal foam. Usually metal foam involve porosity, but it is likely for such a uh, community. And uh, it can be produced also by additive manufacturing and the composition of the materials it's tailored at any location just by uh, making a different material feedings like voxels as shown here in the lower figures, voxels based designs. And finally it is based upon the definitions and required of the quality and the limit for to avoid the, veil, uh, to avoid the failures of the product. It seems that if we, there is an appropriated quality definitions the uh, design uh, products have a uh, very high potentials and thank you for this one.